and hello my beautiful pandas i have an awesome review today so this is the first pair i'm going with all the items that i will be reviewing today will be in the description below along with links and everything so i'm super excited about these when they came from my wish list i was like oh my god they look adorable i really can't wait to try these So just unpackaging both out, just so you can see what they look like. Have a bit of an inspection just before we try them on. And how adorable do these look? I actually really like these, but I will say these are slightly too big for me. As I'm wearing hosiery as well, my feet are slipping a little bit in these. So when they're being pushed forward, you have that gapping at the back, which doesn't look that pretty. But I'd have to make do for this video now. So as you can see, cute peep toe front. And I have to say, I actually really do like the way it looks with my hosiery on. I think it looks super classy compared to how I can imagine it would look dressed otherwise but yeah I actually really do like this and I actually really do like the heels on them as well they're really different compared to what you normally see on mules um, and I think I actually think they look lovely and on to my next pair now this pair I'm super psyched about because this just screams vintage to me it's that whole vintage pump like slightly lower heel that really lovely caramel toffee color i absolutely love it and when i saw these i was like oh my god i am so so happy so i'm just going to show you what they're like doing a little inspection making sure they're all okay and we can take it from there And they're on and this is how awesome they are looking now I will mention these are a very snug fit I mean luckily I'm wearing hosiery so it kind of slims my foot down slightly but without hosiery my foot would struggle to get into these shoes so it's a shame because I absolutely love them but I know I won't be able to last or even walk around in these for hours without them aching and hurting my feet. Especially if I have long toenails as well. But otherwise, I think they look amazing and I really, really do like these. I need these in every colour, basically. Okay, so I can't tell you how excited I am for this pair. Now, I love the brand June and I mean with a passion, I love this brand. They're such classy pairs and they always come out with styles that I absolutely love and this is one of them basically I just I wish they weren't so expensive sometimes but yeah I absolutely love June and I'm absolutely digging this pair when it first came I was like I really got to get these reviewed ASAP so yeah so this is what we're working with And now that they're on, oh my god, they look like fake Valentinos from far. But do you know what? I don't I don't care. I prefer the June version. They're more affordable and they still look super, super classy. And I wouldn't be too scared to wear them out and about. So yeah, they look absolutely great. They fit really, really nicely on the feet. I've got a slight bit of room. But do you know what? I prefer that rather than having it too, too snug. And I love the studding detail. I love the fact that the buckle is adjustable as well. And there's plenty of little holes to poke it in too. I just love the overall look. And the heel height is really, really nice. It's not too high and not too low. So that it makes it suitable for work and just basically plodding around. Okay, so a lot of you will have seen this on my IG stories not that long ago. And I just had to include these in my video review. I just, I had to. 
they're absolutely incredible and probably the second highest pair i own um so yeah it's just these are uh these are i'm actually really really excited about just to see what they're like and if i can actually walk in them <laughs> and not stumble around but yeah i really do like them actually they do look a little bit provocative but well so be it when you're working with a platform like that it's it's going to now one thing i did notice here is there are a couple of scratches um they weren't done by me i will say that they did come like that so it's just something just to point out but i'm hoping not every pair that you purchase is going to be like this Right, so can I tell you how proud I am? The fact that I got them on and I can walk in them. And let me just say, they are so comfortable. Like, I'm not standing on the balls of my feet at all. Like, my feet are still relatively kind of, a little bit arched, but still kind of flat. And they're actually really comfortable. I don't feel like I'm going to fall over wearing these. And they fit really, really well. They're really nice and comfortable, slightly padded inside. And I'm absolutely loving this heel. This is such a killer heel. They're just, they're actually a great pair. Yes, once again, provocative, I know. But I really do like them. Especially when they are this comfortable. Yeah, they're actually a really nice pair of heels. Okay, so switching it up from heels to flats. This is another pair I really, really liked when I saw them and I had to put them on my wish list. So I'm kind of getting into Chelsea boots. I was never a big fan before. But now that I'm getting into them, I really want to experiment with like different kind of designs and um, different kind of looks. And to be fair, this is one where you can't go wrong with all black with a little bit of studded detail. Okay, so I did find in one of the parts there was a little bit of a crack, but luckily it's not too noticeable, but something worth noting down. Okay, I'm not going to lie, I actually feel really short now, but I am digging these boots. So these are only very slightly too big for me. If I went half the size down, I feel these would be perfect. But in terms of sizing, it is slightly big, but I'm not too fast. I can literally just pad this out inside, either with thick socks or like with insoles. But I really like these. I love the way they look. They're super funky. They're like a edgy chic, especially like the way I've kind of dressed them as well today. Like it's kind of edgy chic. And I think they actually look amazing. It's like a nice little heel height to them. So you still have that. But yeah, I absolutely think they look awesome. Okay, and the one that a lot of you have been waiting for, because once again, I've put this on my Instagram stories a little while back, and I was very, very scared on how to dress these the right way. I realised I couldn't, I couldn't do it, so I thought, you know what, I'm just going to do a show and tell video on them instead. But yeah, this is this is the serious height we're working with today. And I just want to show you the inside as well, just so you can see how nice and smooth it is. So if you was wearing this with bare legs, it's, you know, it'll be nice and comforting around the legs rather than an itchy kind of material. Right, these bad boys are on and this is how they're looking. I've got to say they're actually very comfortable and they're very easy to walk in. I didn't feel like i was gonna trip over at any point or stumble around like a little deer they're actually quite comfortable and i'm really really happy to say that so these they have like a side zip just i want to show you here so you can easily get your foot and legs in in and out quite quite easily basically there's not, nothing more i could really say there but um yeah they actually look okay they're not really my cup of tea but they're okay 
if you can dress them right um they sit sort of mid thigh on me so it's not a bad thing either so you could probably wear like a pair of jeans underneath this if you really want um but there's nothing to hold it up and to be fair these are quite baggy on me around the thighs it's it doesn't look that great but never mind there's not much i can do there but yeah so not a bad pair i can walk in them i can happily say but in terms of how they look i'm still a bit unsure And last but not least is this gorgeous pair I've been dying to review for a while now because it's been sitting there patiently waiting for me. And I, I'm so happy I get to finally show you what they look like on. So I just want to show you a bit of an unboxing video just to see, sorry, just to show you how they come packed. So you know what to expect, like if you decide to purchase a pair, they come nicely padded out, nicely wrapped just to keep the diamantes in place while they're jiggling around in the box and they're falling off everywhere. They are very well stuck on here, but it's not something that would rub my finger and one would come off, so I'm happy about that. And as far as I'm aware, I didn't see any other faults, to be honest. Right, so the hoser came off for this one just because they didn't work with my shoes and I just wanted just to show it in all its glory here. So this is what they look like on. They fit really, really well. They're not too tight around the feet, which I'm happy about because Perspex can sometimes cut into your feet a little bit and just feel really horrible and it can irritate you. So I, I don't like that. So I'm glad these shoes don't do that. But I really like the way they look. It's They're actually quite classy. You know, there's not too many gems on them to make it look cheap and i really like the whole nude base with the nude heel as well it just it, to me it works i actually think they're really really nice and these would look great with any outfit whether you pair it with hosiery or just have them on barefoot i actually really like these 